I'm uh, from Hungary. My name is uh, Balázs Lőrinc. Uh, my nickname on the HW bot is Achilleus, uh, or, or Ba, how do you guys know uh, this name? I'm uh, an IT support analyst in uh, Hungary, in an IT outsourcing company. So I do hardware and software as well, and some networking. So uh, I have uh, time to spend uh, with uh, the hardware as well. <laughs> I started overclocking about uh, 10 years ago, uh, but I skipped a couple of years because of uh, too busy with life and uh, other things. Um, yeah, the motivation was about to start overclocking. To was very simple to make your computer faster uh, because new games uh, requirements are pretty much high, always higher than the PC you had at the time, so uh, what to do, what to do, how to make it faster, let's overclock it. And then uh, by time, uh, overclocking was more uh, important and more, more fun uh, than actually the games. So <laughs> I skipped the gaming and uh, focused uh, only the overclocking part and always uh, invented uh, more uh, better and better cooling solutions, uh, air cooling, water cooling, uh, Phase change, uh, dry ice, uh, and then uh, liquid nitrogen, of course, which is the most fun. Of course, the live, live, uh, live events. Uh, the live events to meet uh, the other guys, the, the other uh, addicted uh, guys of overclocking is, is the best part of, part of it. Uh, in Hungary, uh, I can say I was uh, the first generation of extreme overclockers. So uh, it's uh, nice to build a community in your own country and see the guys uh, get uh, the fun part of it and they uh, asking uh, help and questions uh, to you. And at the end, they also reach really nice results and uh, it's really, really good to see that improving. So uh, the best part, uh, if you were uh, asking for results, uh, uh, back in time we made uh, a lot of world records with uh, core to do CPUs, frequency world records. Um, I never uh, spent that much time with uh, 3D because uh, it's a lot of uh, uh, time, a lot of uh, money to invest in graphic cards, put LN to do all the mods. You know, it's, it's uh, I can say it's for the for the elite guys. In 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 Hungary, we made it uh, with much simple resources, much much uh, simple focus on, only uh, on the CPU stuff and, and the memory stuff, of course. Actually, when I entered the overclocking field, uh, the main uh, uh, source of the information it was XM systems. Uh, all the guys have been posting the, the results from all over the world and uh, everything was shared. Uh, the mods, the, the software uh, tweaks, uh, everything was, was shared. But uh, when the vendors uh, get into the game and make competitions, uh, everyone started to, to keep uh, uh, the secrets and because uh, of the money and to get that uh, sponsorship was, uh, I think, was Im important for everyone, and uh, it was a game changer completely. I, I th as the way I think. I think it's uh, it's because of because of you guys because of HW bot invented a lot of money and effort uh, for doing the uh, the competitions uh, even for the amateurs the novice uh, guys for the water cooler guys so uh, they they uh, if if the motivation for them it's. Uh, bigger than before because uh, they can do, uh, they have their own league, they can do uh, even results to, to one uh, nice prizes, if, uh, even if they are gamers, they uh, have an interest in it and um, that's why, that's why this community is, is growing but I think uh, it's just, just because of, of you, you been pushing this uh, very hard. I think it was the same in the past but uh, it was not fun uh, for these people uploading this course. Why, why, why been uh, doing this if you compare it with Sub-Zero or LN2 results? It's not fun to see that you're in, uh, below 10,000 people. It's not, uh, 
not no no motivation, but uh, but you changed it, and uh, it's nice to see. Nice to see. But I think uh, the, the the community, it's uh, the extreme guys, the extreme open community, is uh, smaller than it was before, and that's because of these reasons. Uh, parts are getting ex more expensive, uh, and and. Uh, People buying less uh, desktop PC, and it's and it's affected uh, even on the on the community because if I see Hungary as, I, as the way we, we do it, uh, I many times buy used hardware because uh, uh, vendors giving uh, no free hardware, so I have to do, to buy it my own. And uh, it's also a point of view if uh, I do a testing uh, after that if it's not not good for for. Uh, for sub-zero results, uh, I sell it. And if you cannot sell because uh, people are not buying to buy it, it's uh, also a point of view. When in, in Eastern Europe, we are not uh, rich guys to buy an uh, eight-core CPU. Actually, to be here, uh, it's really nice uh, for me and to have the chance to test the Intel's eight-core CPU because I never had the chance to do that. I cannot afford to buy a 1,500 euro CPU. So, so that's also a, a part of the game, the way I see it. As the motiva like I said uh, previous, the motivation uh, you've been doing the, at HW Bot, um, it's pretty strong. So people uh, who just started, uh, or just about to start overclocking, uh, uh, could uh, could be interested about it uh, because uh, they can win uh, prizes. They they can see how to to improve the, themselves and compare the scores uh, on the, their own uh, league. So how to say? Uh, keep pushing it. <laughs> uh, my first time as Computex. First time, first time in uh, Taipei. Uh, I love this city. The people are very nice here, and uh, the the impression is uh, very good. I've been uh, already in the Asian uh, region, uh, in uh, Thailand, Bangkok. Uh, this is a completely different city. It's uh, much cleaner and uh, much uh, compared to the to the. Uh, Europe or the, the Western uh, nations, let's say that uh, it's much more open-minded, uh, like other countries I've, I've seen here in the region. So I love it. Want to come back? <laughs>